Hawaii-born researcher wants to help farmers across the islands by giving them a hand. Well, a robotic arm to be exact. As our Jim Mendoza reports, the invention could reduce costs and boost sustainability. Okay, ready? Researcher Kyle Yoshida believes reviving Hawaii's agriculture industry rests in the hands of robots. He's on a team at Washington State University that's in the early stages of developing a robotic arm that could harvest fruits and vegetables. What if we could automate some of those processes to make uh, labor lower cost, reduce the dependence on labor, and thus decreasing the overall price of your goods? The 2014 graduate of Kamehameha Schools holds a degree from Harvard and a PhD in mechanical engineering from Stanford. He received a prestigious fellowship from the Washington Research Foundation to fund his work that could put Hawaii on the leading edge of cost-effective farming. Hawaii can be kind of that leader where we're creating these new innovations and inventions that can be used throughout the world. Other startups are working on similar projects, but Yoshida believes at about $1,000, his robot would be affordable for most of Hawaii's small farms. And there are other tasks robots could do. So for instance, you can have robots that get, get deployed when there's a rainstorm to sample different nutrient compositions to see if we should change water flow, for example. Yoshida's goal is to help Hawaii grow more of its own food and create a reliable source for affordable produce. That would reduce the state's reliance on imported goods. When I see agriculture now, um, when we walk into a grocery store, a lot of things are imported, like even things that we would expect are grown locally. A lot of it is actually imported. On a side note, he's also in charge of a nonprofit called Honua Scholars that encourages Hawaii youth to pursue STEM careers that support the state. And I have to give a shout out to my science fair teacher, Miss um, Ishimoto, who really set me on the path of science research, um, doing those state science fairs and then leading into my career currently. Yoshida recently tested his robot prototype in Hawaii. I'm very optimistic about the future and I think that there's a lot of potential room for growth. And I think that a key component in that growth will be collaboration with the community and different farmers. If he can take his robot to market, it could take a load off farmers by taking the heavy lifting out of their hands. I'm Jim Mendoza for Hawaii News Now. Oh, that's great. Maybe yeah. more, no more.